He made war as a means to achieve peace, said brother-in-law and advisor Mauricio Rodriguez about Colombian President Juan Manuel Santos. A full peace deal is signed between the Colombian government and the Revolutionary Armed Forces of Colombia on September 26th in its Caribbean city of Cartagena. Sandoz has overseen a definitive end to the largest, longest, and last civil war in Latin America after three and a half years of negotiation. For más de medio siglo, no hemos sido un país normal. Por más de medio siglo, hemos cargado con el lastre de un conflicto armado interno que nos genera el estigma de ser el país diferente del continente. The almost 65-year-old conservative politician spearheaded a major offensive against the FARC as defense minister from 2006 to 2009. After becoming president in June 2010, he shifted track and negotiated for peace, weakening the FARC to oblige them to sit at the table until the full peace accord is achieved. Teníamos que soltar este lastre. Teníamos que quitar este obstáculo del camino de nuestro desarrollo y nuestro progreso social. Teníamos que entrar por fin al tercer milenio. Sandoz came from a wealthy and powerful family, an economist by profession and journalist by trade. His great-uncle once served as head of state of the South American country. After serving the Navy of Colombia, Sandoz was educated at the University of Kansas, the London School of Economics and Political Science. Within the Colombian government, he had held ministerial posts of foreign trade, finance and public credit, as well as defense.